a few components. I'm going to start with a couple transistors here. So, I'm going to set the camera down. I'm going to try to stay close so I don't mumble this time. Okay, a, a basic uh, signal transistor. This is a 2N3904. Let Real common NPN transistor, I believe. Anyway, that's a base emitter. That's collector emitter. It's base collector. Now, if I went to look at collector emitter, I can uh, sort uh, the base in either side of the test leads with. Uh, my finger and actually produce amplification you know just by having the the sine wave going through the collector emitter I can bleed some of it into the base and if I don't feel anything but uh, you know it's about 12 volts the you know real low current the sine wave so you know if you want to use a here's the power transistor if you want to use a uh, potentiometer, resistor, capacitor, make a little test jig. That you know that that's actually more time-consuming, but it'd be faster if you're going to do repetitive measurements. And uh, you know I've never really put a chart on this, but you're you know you can look it up on the scope and get actual voltage measurements of you know what's allowed. Um, Anyway, uh, I'm going to dig around in the junk box. I found a, let's see what we got here. I found a little 